Hi and welcome back to the channel and thank you so much for clicking into this video. Today I'm going to teach you how you can fix your 5M error code 502. So make sure that you stay until the very end of this video so you won't miss any important step or information that I am going to show you or tell you in this video. So let's get on it. So the first fix that I am going to show you is to check your internet connection. So you can start by verifying your internet connection. You need to ensure that you have a stable and reliable internet connection. So here are the steps to do that. First, what you can do is to turn off your router or modem. Just wait for a few seconds and then you can turn it back on. But if the problem still, still persists, you can reset your network settings on your device. So you'll need to go to your network settings menu and look for an option to reset or restart network settings. And if you're using Wi-Fi, you can try switching to a wired connection to roll out any potential wireless issues. And you can even restart your router or modem to refresh the connection. So that's it for the first fix and the second one is to check 5M server status. Determine if the 5M server is, is experiencing any issues or any known issues or undergoing maintenance. So if the server is down or undergoing maintenance, the error 502 is likely temporary so you can try again later. And then you can even visit the official 5M server's website to check for any announcements or updates regarding the server status. And then next, what you can do is to connect to a different service using 5M console. So by putting or by inputting accurate server details, you bypass any potential issues related to the server. So this workaround has worked for many users. However, it is important to note that this may not work for all users. So to connect, to a different server using the 5M client console, you can do this. So first, you need to open the console by pressing the F8 key on your keyboard and then press the command, paste the command right here. It is this right here. So you can go ahead and pause this video and type this video or copy this video in your device. So you paste this command in the console and replace the server IP with the actual IP address and the server port with the correct port number of the server. And after doing so, you can press enter to initiate the connection attempt. And then next, what you can do is to try again later. So if the 5M server is experiencing temporary issues or high traffic, it is advisable to wait for some time and try connecting again later. So the 502 error may resolve itself once the server stabilizes or the issues causing the error is resolved. And then next, what you can do is to contact 5M support. So if the 502 error persists or if you require additional assistance, you can reach out to the 5M support team. They can, they can provide guidance, troubleshoot the issue, and offer specific solutions tailored to your situation. So that's it for this video. So remember, you can always pause this video or go back to the video and follow the steps at your own time. So I hope this video helped you. And if it did, please make sure to like subscribe and click notification bell button so you won't miss a video thank you so much for watching and have a great day bye bye